and welcome to the fourth edition of the Women's Liège Baston Liège. 135 riders at the start this morning, a bit of rain and plenty of heavy hitters. World champion Anna van der Breggen chasing a third victory in this race and looking to double up in the Ardennes Classics after winning La Flèche Ballon on Wednesday. Defending champion Annemiek van Vleuten also in the mix after missing La Flèche. Other potential winners include Mariana Voss, Lizzie Dagnan, Elisa Longo Borghini and Katarzyna Neviadoma. Well, this is what lies ahead, 135 kilometres between Bastogne and Liège. A bumpy parkour with five climbs, the Côte de Van, the Côte de la Haute Levée, the Côte de la Vecchie, the Côte de la Redoute, and the all-important Côte de la roche au which comes inside the final 15 kilometres before a fast run-in to the finish line in Liège. There was a fast and furious start today with no early breakaway. Eventually though, a group of nine riders managed to get up the road. Some big names in there, including Mariana Voss and Lizzie Dagnan. They opened up a maximum gap of 1 minute 40 on the peloton. The top three at Flesch Vallon, van der Breggen, Cecily Utrup Ludwig and Demi Follering all in the main pack. With 30 kilometres to go, Dagnan attacked. The 2015 world champion going clear on the penultimate climb, the Côte de la Redoute, and moving about a minute ahead, And the British rider was still leading with 12k to go after the final climb, but Australia's Grace Brown was in hot pursuit. The Mitchelton Scott rider, a teammate of Van Vleuten, gradually closing the gap, but she still trailed Dagnan by around 20 seconds heading into the final kilometre. Lizzie Dagnan out of the saddle now, trying to get as much power as possible into the pedal. She takes a little look round to see where Grace Brown is. 150 metres remaining for the British rider, the former world champion, the former British road race champion. She zips up her jersey, she shakes her head, she can't believe it. Lizzie Dynan points to her jersey. She's done it, she is the winner of the 2020 Liège Baston Liège. Well, what a performance from Lizzie Dagnan to take her 39th career victory. Two years after giving birth to a daughter, the 31-year-old is very much back to her best, adding Liège Bast on Liège to her glittering CV only a few weeks after she won La Course by the Tour de France. Trek Segafredo executing their race plan brilliantly to claim their 11th win of this season. Pretty special, yeah. Actually, we've been waiting to win a classic like this, and I think we've been almost there so many times. And um, I just had the perfect team today. This is for the team. This is the Trek Segafredo win. What was the plan? Did did you actually decide to take off uh, at La, La Redoute this morning uh, during the briefing or not? No, I think the the nicest thing about this team is that we're allowed to win, uh, to race on instinct, and not to fear failure. So confirmation of the top 10 on the day, Brown falling just short but still claiming an impressive second place with Dagnan's Trek Segafredo teammate Ellen van Tyck completing the podium. So the rider from Yorkshire, the toast of Liège and the first non-Dutch winner of this race. As an added bonus, she recovers the lead of the UCI Women's World Tour from Anna van der Breggen.